everyone, I'm Anne the Evangelical Catholic, back after a long break. It's been a few months, hasn't it? Well, I want to share my glory story for the past few months. I would say that in April and in March a great deal of glorious things happened. I finally have made it back into my house this May, and this is the new and updated wall. It's like the same corner, but uh, new, new paint, new wall. So, super happy about that, to be back at home. So I want to talk about this past March and how things went rather well. There was just some rough moments, but I was very grateful to have the opportunity to go on a silent retreat for the weekend. I made it there safely and it was just a good time for silent reflection, grow closer to God, and have that time, quality time with Him, and just better understand what his call for me was in a way that I hadn't really felt or heard or, or had that movement in me, me before, not to the same degree in the longest of time. So it was very, very helpful and beneficial. And I think it was um, spiritually healing. It was, it was needed for what I was going through in my life, as I mentioned before, the, the whole new house thing and not being able to come because of all the, the repairs being done and all the the walls being painted, everything that was happening, the like reconstruction that was happening, uh, it was it was very nice to to spend the time in a retreat. Even though I was already away from home, uh, it was it was nice to have some time to myself. Even though I was in a retreat with other people, who I only sort of kind of knew. There was like maybe a few f people I I was actually acquainted with and, and a friend with there, but. I think it was good to have have that time. It was very helpful. And of course, April is a season of a great deal of birthdays that month, and it was Easter, so that was pretty pretty exciting as well. A very blessed and beautiful Easter indeed. Got to see my grandpa, who is now in a nursing home and thankfully is still doing well to this day. I, of course, I got to move back in during this May and I got to see so many kids graduate and um, hear from them this uh, this month. I went on a mission trip where we go for um, a week or from Monday to Friday. We spend time with the poor and help out the little sisters and the Franciscans and help out at the soup kitchen and the homeless shelters and the nursing home and to see how how involved the kids would get and how much they got out of it and of course with the year wrapping up it was it was just great to see the kids like graduate it was great to to see the life that the kids have and how full of happiness and joy they are and uh, how grateful that they are and how far they've grown throughout these years because I've been in youth ministry for six years so all that was like pretty amazing that um, God was working so hard through through us and and I could see that he's re revealed his like glory through through these teenagers seeing how dedicated they are and how faithful they are and how selfless they they, they are and have become and I'm just grateful for being part of it even though I believe that it is time for me to try a different sort of ministry I definitely want to continue to serve and I'm grateful to, to have been part of this this journey of, of faith of, of young people and to have served this way and it was a very glorious thing to see and um, so much so it's kind of like hard to go but um, but it's God's glory that is being done no matter no matter where he called me and it's because of him that, that all these glorious things happen and are happening and I'm pretty excited to see what happens this fall and I'm very grateful for all the glorious things God has done in these past few months and to be back here in my own home again and to start making videos again hopefully I'll get my computer back or a new computer something like that to we can better edit videos and get videos out sooner and more often uh, who knows where, where that will lead but I'm grateful to be back once again, back home, and be able to make videos once again. So thanks 
for sh for uh, sharing this with me. Thank you and God bless. Bye. Thank <laughs> you.